Yeah. Uh, the abs are made in the kitchen. So hey, we're talking about food here this morning. He'll have to choose in the house. But why are we here? Because, you know, the Olympics is going on. People see these athletes and like, how do they jump so high? How are they so strong? How do they swim so fast? As much as they work out, nutrition is probably one of the biggest things when it comes to competing at the Olympic level. Shoot, you can start this in high school. I wish I had services like this in high school. I, I probably would still be playing football right now, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So Healthy Chew is here in the house. We got TJ and Chef Pete in the house. So TJ, I want to uh, start with you. You know, uh, I can already tell you look fit, all right? You know what I mean? All right, I'm already looking at it. He's got his arms <laughs> out, you know, he's looking good. Nutrition is such a big thing. I'm sure you work out, but just talk about what Healthy Chew is and what it wants to offer to its clients. So Healthy Chew is uh, it's a weekly service. Basically, we try to make the foods that you know and love mm -hmm. in a healthier spin to them. Yes. So we offer things like our uh, meatloaf mm -hmm. and our... Um, Creole Cajun chicken pasta, casserole, stuff like that. But every single uh, every single offering we have comes with the serving of either fruits or vegetables. Yes, yes. And, and like I said, I understand how balanced it is, and I can already see it right now. They got stuff from breakfast sandwiches. They got eggs with some potato hash in there and everything. They got breakfast, lunch, and dinner set up right now. But, you know, I want to talk to the men behind everything right here. Chef Pete's over here, all right? You know, he's been apparently TikTok famous <laughs> here in the house, you know. Mm. But um, when people start hearing these programs, they're like, is this just some... Um, food that's in a frozen thing all day. You have a team that gets in the kitchen, makes everything fresh, makes everything healthy. Tell, tell, tell us about the uh, the mastermind behind everything. Tell us how all this works. Well, when I created this company like five years ago, I wanted to make sure that everything was fresh. And mm -hmm. our lingo was to make it design, you know, unhealthy foods to healthy foods and stuff. Yes. So um, we have a team that's like, you know, dedicated to making everything and following our mission to make sure that everything's fresh. And so, uh, yeah. And did I mention we're the only meal prep company that offers more than four portioning programs like okay. medium, large, extra large, and then cool. keto and low carb? Yep. Yeah. And I'm about to say, a lot of people you know are keto who count macros and do all this stuff. It's very difficult to keep track. Well, it's easy when you have a chef, Pete, and his team knocking it out for you. But I'm eating Pringles this morning. Right? <laughs> Pringles, man. And, I, and the reason I'm eating Pringles this morning is because I wake up early and I just didn't have the time to wake up, make a balanced breakfast. Just talk about how this is making life convenient for people. It's convenient because every week you order sometime Monday through Thursday. We send out a text message on Tuesday and Thursday to anybody that needs a reminder. Oh, nice. Uh, Friday, the orders close, and then we produce those uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then deliveries go out Sunday, Monday. So as long as you get your order in by Thursday at midnight, yep. we'll have this ready for you. All rock right. and roll. So when it comes to ordering options and how you can place an order, be a new client, do all this stuff, don't worry about it. We're going to take care of that. We're going to put all that information on our website. And if they want to follow you on social media real quick, what do they need to check out? Uh, Healthy Chew on Instagram and Healthy Chew Kitchen on Facebook. TikTok? Uh, what's your TikTok? Maybe, maybe, maybe afterwards. <laughs> no, afterwards. Maybe afterwards. <laughs> I'm going to check out his TikTok. I already heard about it. Thank you all so much for being here this morning. Once again, all this information will be on our website at krk.com.